Greetings and salutations. My name is Oracult and welcome back. back. It may not be back. <sighs> if you're coming back to the channel and you've already subscribed to it, thank you very, very much. Um, I... that will... Mm. <sighs> thank you very much. Greetings and salutations, my name is Oracult and welcome to my sanctuary. For those of you who are new here, you're very welcome, hope you like the content. Consider subscribing and liking the video if you do. If you don't, tell me why. Don't just dislike it and go away, just tell me. I can improve, I swear. And for those of you who are not new here and who also, in fact, could have even subscribed to this channel, I thank you very, very much and welcome back. Today I thought we'd do something a little different. What we will be covering today is jewelry. We all love Alchemy Gothic because it's, well, it's a staple, it's classic. However, there are other things out there. It's the new age of new technology. Laser cutting. Do we see this? How amazing is that? If you really like this, consider sticking around and finishing the video. So this is from a brand based in the UK and established in Leeds in 2014 called House of Bats. Now I've heard about House of Bats from YouTubers, the UK ones especially, who are on point with what's happening in goth fashion over there. And I'm down here in New Zealand, so we have bugger all and, well, it's kind of tough here. So House of Bats does absolutely stunning laser cut jewelry and now they've even branched out into clothing and when I say they I really mean she because it's run by Anna who is the owner and she started it um, in 2014 and has been running it pretty much as I as far as I know anyway single-handedly I've ordered this stuff ages ago I've had it for ages but I didn't have a YouTube channel and barely did anything with it but I thought you know I, I'd get this out and actually show people because th there have been multiple UK youtubers talking about it that's how I found out but but she ships worldwide and I think everyone should check it out because it's an amazing brand so not only does Anna produce absolutely gorgeous stuff it's laser cut by her we, we know where it comes from we know it's recycled material so we know it's sustainable Sustainable, we know it's ethical, it's beautiful, and this is incredible. 10% of all of it, everything she gets, goes to the Sophie Lancaster Foundation. And I will link everything down below along with the information on House of Bats. Sophie Lancaster basically was killed for being goth, and it's just it's horrific that this kind of thing still happens and in the quite recently it's, it's not yesterday but it's still uh, it's just it's it's mm, I, I have no words for that really uh, it, there's quite a number of videos that came out recently as well which i will link down below um big thanks to mama goth and, and heavy metal mama for putting it all together and there's quite a few other people in that video participating from the goth youtube community I will link all of that down below so you can check out the story and then the foundation itself and what they do. But basically they're the, trying to promote and educate against people discriminating on, you know, solely the basis of looks. Like, it's incredible that that happens. Basically, like, you look at someone and you hate them that much. Uh, I don't even want to talk about it, sorry. I just... Mm. Uh, it, it, it shouldn't happen. Like, it, it shouldn't happen, but it does. It, it's a tragedy, is what it is. So, so House of Bats supports that, that foundation and, and helping with that, which is amazing. Another thing I've picked up about the House of Bats, well, I, I've ordered ages ago, that's what I'm saying. I, I've been following on Instagram for a while as well. And Anna managed to um, recover from COVID last year and she had to close down for a while so and i hope you're you know fully recovered and doing well and that the business is all fine but looking at the website it's it's booming and now anna's also branched out not only for doing jewelry but also into clothing and that looks amazing i will post a few pictures and post some links to that and it's it's all absolutely beautiful how talented can you get so yeah without further ado i will show you a few other items 
So all the items I got seem to be from the Bathory collection and so these cross earrings and cross choker there's also a necklace version with a chain and I think all of that is adjustable as well so you don't have to have it up here you can put it down there the, this is also adjustable by the way as well because there's a that bit that you always have on chains that makes it longer or shorter or whatever as I love crosses and this this is so buffy this is so buffy a cross and it kind of looks like a stake and vampires and bathory it all sort of ties in nicely together so it's a great concept and it's so simple yet so effective this one is very similar but this is called the blood drop cross choker and of course you know you gotta have a girl's gotta have matching earrings how beautiful are these and they're pretty big but I like that they, they look nice and also because you know my hair is black, the, the, the red droplet will stand out. I will show you when I do a trial. And also to match with these earrings, so you don't have to wear the same necklace all the time. There you go, vampire teeth and blood droplets. Hey. Gorgeous, right? Gorgeous. I will try that on as well. And the last item I got was this triple moon choker. Again, I love moons. Most of our bedroom is moons, moons, moons. I have moon clothes. I have moon everything. I have moon cushions. Like, it's one of my favorite things ever and the phases of the moon. So, yeah, that's really cool as well. And it all came, like the earrings came on these really cute House of Bats sort of uh, holders. And it has the, this is the logo. Absolutely gorgeous. I will post all of that down below, all the items and the website and various links as promised. And without further ado, let me show you what this looks like on. This one, there's something about the moons. I gotta admit, I love that so much. I do like the cross, but this this is just so perfect. So yeah, that was House of Bats. Amazing, amazing brand. Uh, hopefully you have heard of them, and if you haven't heard of them and you're hearing about them from me for the first time, I'm super proud. That means I've you know done my job and informed people. Well, it's remarkable how someone can rebuild their life, build amazing brand to be sustainable and ethical and charitable all at the same time whilst producing gorgeous stuff like this. I really hope to check out the clothes very, uh, very soon as well. So stay tuned. That will be coming at some stage. It will take ages to ship over to over here in New Zealand, but I'm sure we'll get there. I will link everything down below as promised. If you like this video, amazing. Please do come back, like, subscribe to the channel, and if you've already subscribed, thank you, because that shows that I should keep making these, and you know, if nobody subscribes, what is the point? I make this for you, uh, I make it somewhat for me, but mostly for you, and I really enjoy interacting with you guys, so please comment down below if you want to talk about anything in the video, have any questions about any of these items, or, you know, have any general constructive, constructive criticism. You know, you're more than welcome to. Greetings and salutations. I hope you do stay. I hope you join me for more videos in my sanctuary and have a pleasant day wherever you may be.